Hey cats and chicks, you know who it is, Slickback Rocker here. Let's get started with this, shall we? So, this is a pomade I've been wanting to dry, try out for a very long time. And that is Murray's Super Light. Now, the reason why I want to try this out because, well for one, Murray's is one of my favorite pomade companies of all time. All right, they're one of my favorites. And not only that, I like just trying stuff from Murray's, but not only that, but Murray's, normal Murray's can be a little bit much sometimes, so I want to see if this is light enough, but still heavy enough to hold my hair in place. And I just wanted to try it out and see what it can do with my hair, um, and we're going to find out. I've never tried this, but I'm very excited to try it because, like I said, I like Murray's, you know, hair, their hair products in general, but... Um, Mars, like I said, can get a little bit too much sometimes, and I'm and right now I'm switching out between Murray's 50 Batch and Murray's Edge Wax and Murray's Hair Superior. So I'm kind of like in a Murray's thing right now. So I figured, why not bust this video out, uh, out and put it up? And uh, yeah, Murray's Super Light. I love the artwork. Murray's always has good artwork on their cans. Always good. Ooh, this one smells really good. It's got like a birthday cake kind of smell to it. All right, for those of you who've ever smelled Mary Super Light before, I know what it smells like. It's got like a birthday cake kind of smell to it. Not bad. I like the smell of it. All right, so this is what the pomade looks like. Looks like pretty much like Murray's 50 batch. Like that same light tannish color. Who knows? Now, now I do have some Murray's 50-50 in right now. But it's not really holding my hair because there's not too much in. So that's why we're going to do this video here. And I'm going to put some more pomade in and try some different pomades out together and put them together and see if they work. And Murray's Super Light and Murray's 50 Batch is going to be the first one I try here on the channel. So, like I said, we got 50 Batch in right now. About to put in some Murray's Super Light. Let's go and try it out. Oh, wow. That is very light pomade. It just comes right out. That's what she said. And then, like, literally, like, there's no hole to it at all. It just, like, literally, if you, once you put your finger in there and pull out some pomade, it comes right out. Literally, no joke. Um, but yeah, it's called Rebus This is very, very light. I was not expecting it to be this light. I was expecting maybe, like, a medium light, kind of like on Murray's normally does it, but this is light, man. This is even lighter than, uh, 50 batch. 50 batch, I said in my last video, was light. This is even lighter than that. Because I've never tried this before. Let's, uh... Alright, so let's rub it in. Let's go ahead and rub it in the hair and apply it. It's got a really nice scent to it, man. It's got like a birthday cake scent to it. And I do like that. Birthday cake is a really good scent. At least that's what it smells like to me. I mean, I smell like that to some people, but to me, that's what it smells like. Very sheeny. I like shiny sheen, shine, whatever you want to call it. I like that. Because I don't have pomades that really give that sheen. This is really giving that sheen. Like, I can't even grab the right amount because it just really droops out like that. A little more, a little more, never hurts. We really want to get those sides back, guys. The sides I'm struggling with lately because of all the growing out. And when your sides grow out, then, well, they tend to not go where you want to fucking put them, which gets annoying as hell after a little bit, all right? So sides and the back, because the back is now splitting, and that's what I hate the most. I hate when my fucking back splits like that. All right, so I'm wipe my hands off a little bit. I need to get some of that Murray Super Light off. It's got a really nice sheen to it. I like that. I like pomades with really nice sheens to them. This one has it. A little bit of soap on there as well, might as well, right? But I like pomades that have a nice sheen to it. This pomade has a really nice sheen to it. I'm really digging that. I'm really, you know, liking that. All right, so. Next step is the 
Roll my brush. It's really much dirty as hell. I need to clean some of the grease out of it and the hair parts out of it. But let's go ahead and put this uh, pomade in use and roll brush in use. Now, like I said, it's a very light coating pomade, guys. So if you're expecting some hold to it, there's not going to be much hold to it at all. All right. It's very, very light pomade. It's not the heaviest thing in the world, you know. It's a lot, definitely a lot less heavier than Murray Superior and Murray's 50 Batch. It's just not heavy enough, right? It's called Super Light for a reason, right? Um, but yeah, it's very light coating pomade. Um, but if you did, because if I have a feeling if you put this in by itself, it's not going to hold well. But if you have another pomade in it, in your hair, and you go ahead and put this in with it, then it might hold. But I have a feeling if you try this in by itself, it just might not work. That's just my thought process on it. Uh, it might work in by itself, I honestly don't know. But I'm loving the way this stuff works so far. If I didn't have 50-50 batch in, I don't know if this would work or not. And I think we're just might be about done. You know, I'm not trying to, well, the hair already is back. I think it might be done now. Yeah. All right, cats and chicks, so that is Murray's Super Light. Really, really good stuff. I'm really liking it so far. Let me get the Murray's off this can. There we go. Really liking the stuff so far, man. I'm probably going to go use it for a little bit after I finish up with my Murray's 50 batch if I ever do finish that can. If not, I'm going to switch out between these pomades because this is really good. I'm liking this pomade. Um, it's got a really nice sheen to it. It's very light though, so, you know, don't expect it to be holding, you know, every single piece of hair down like Murray Superior does. This is just a very, very super light pomade. It's called Super Light for a reason, guys. I'm glad I bought this because I can get to try it and use it for the first time. It looks really good. I'm liking it. I'm digging it. Look at the fucking sheen, guys. That is what I like to see. I like pomade with high sheens, and Murray's hair super light here has that sheen. Now... So again, I do have Murray's 5050 in there that has some machine, but this just bumped the sheen up all the way. So it looks even more fucking greasy, which I fucking like. All right. If I'm a greaser, I might as well have fucking greasy looking hair, right? It looks like it's fucking greasy. Well, Super Light does that job. Boom. Anyway, so hope y'all cats and chicks enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the like, subscribe, share, uh, comment, share. I don't, I don't know. Just do all that if you want to. I don't give a fuck if you do or not. Um, follow the Instagram, the Facebook, the Twitter, um, all the other stuff. I'll see you guys and chicks in the next video. Dig it.